Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I have a makeup tutorial look for you guys. It's a nice fall makeup look and it's also using the Lorac Pro Mega 2 palette. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous palette. If you guys haven't gotten it yet, I don't even know if it's sold out actually, but I'll link it down below if it hasn't been sold out. Um, it's a limited edition. It's full of very beautiful, cool tones. It's one of my favorite palettes. So yeah, I've been using this for a while and I wanted to show you guys one of my looks. So if you guys are interested to see how I got this look, keep on watching. So starting out by priming the eye, I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Primer Potion, the anti-aging. And just I'm um, going to be applying this on the eyelids. I'm going to apply also the NYX eyeshadow base um, in the color Nude just to kind of um, cover any veins that I have in my eyelid or anything like that. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. To set the eyeshadow base that I just applied, I'm going to be using the color Custard and applying this all over the lid. Okay, we're going to be grabbing the color Goji and I'm going to be applying this to the crease and I want it very intense on the crease but then blend out on, kind of like fading out. That's what I'm going to be doing here. Now grabbing a little bit of the tangerine shade, I'm going to be applying this um, in the part where it's fading out so it can look more into a transition shade. I don't know if that makes any sense, but that way it looks kind of like dark and then kind of faded with the tangerine there as well. I'm going to be applying the shade Dark Sienna and using an e.l.f. Um, angled brush to apply just on the outer V of the eye and just blending it out. I'm also going to be grabbing the the brush that I used to apply the color Goji and just um, blending those two shades together. Now for the rest of the lid I'm going to be applying this shade called Peony and starting from the inner corner to just the center until where it meets with Dark Sienna I'm going to be applying it and then going back with that elf angled brush and blending those two so it doesn't look any harsh lines in between those two shades. To highlight under my eyebrow I'm going to be using the shade Porcelain. For eyelashes, I'm going to be applying um, Coco Lashes and the Style Risky. For foundation, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Fit Me foundation, the matte and the dewy one. So I just usually mix these two together just to give me that consistency that I want, not too matte and not too dewy, just a perfect combination. By the way, I had already used my Bare Minerals Primetime BB Primer Cream and the shade Medium before I even started um, priming my eyelids, so just wanted to throw that in there. For concealer, I'm going to be using the LA Girl Pro Conceal, and this is in the shade Creamy Beige. So I'm going to be applying this under my eyes and a little bit of the bridge of my nose, forehead, and chin as well, and my cupid's bow. To set my concealer, I'm going to be using a Ben Nye um, Banana Powder and applying this um, pretty much in the areas where I applied my concealer. Going back to the eyes, I'm going to be using um, Dark Sienna to apply under the lash uh, on my bottom lash line. <laughs> and uh, actually, I'm going to be applying it and actually going a little bit higher, just kind of making it look like if I have a wing there because I did not... Um, feel like wearing eyeliner today so I just kind of made it look like if I had a, a wing eyeliner I don't know if that makes any sense but it looked really nice I really like how it looked then I'm gonna be grabbing the color Goji and using a pencil brush to pretty much blend those two shades together 
For my waterline, I'm going to be using the Tarte Skinny Smolder Eyes in the shade Golden Tiger's Eye. It's a really nice coppery bronze look um, color. It's really pretty. For mascara, I'm going to be applying the Lorac Pro Mascara in the color Black. To highlight the inner corner of my eye, I'm going to be applying the color Moonlight. I didn't notice I didn't highlight the inner corner until I put my mascara on. Alrighty, to set my foundation, I'm going to be using the Fit Me um, Powder Foundation and the shade 230. Um, same shade I used for my foundation as well, my liquid foundation. To bronze up my face a little, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil um, bronzer and just applying it to the hollows on my cheeks, around my temples, under my jawline, and my nose. For blush, I'm going to be using the Cargo um, Blush in the shade Cable Beach. Oh my god, this is, this is a really pretty blush. I really, really like this one. It gives it a little bit of a shimmer, but it's just so gorgeous. I really love it. To hide, I'm going to be using um, Becca's Highlighter in the shade, Champ in the shade Champagne Pop. For the lips, I'm going to be using ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip and the shade Tool. So this is the final look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and you liked this tutorial. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and until next time guys, I will see you later. Bye guys.